we are here, you know, at Milton Keynes uh, for the launch of our new car, the RV20. Um, yeah, it's always exciting, you know, being able to, to launch a new car and yeah, seeing the, the work of everyone, you know, being put into the car. So uh, yeah, it's a good day. I, I feel normal. I feel the same as I felt last year. I'm just excited to get back in the car and, and see how competitive the car is going to be. I think last year, of course, we had an incredible year. Um, you know, we've won so many races and, and broke quite a few records as well along the way. Um, so it's definitely going to be hard to try and um, yeah, do something similar. But that's also not entirely the aim. You know, we want to, of course, win. We want to win the championship, but it doesn't always need to be record breaking. Let's say like that. Yeah, for me, of course, it's, I'm also almost part for halfway of that. Uh, you know, uh, of the way of Red Bull in, in F1. So um, from my side, it's, it's definitely like a second family. Um, I really uh, grew up, you know, in here. And um, yeah, it's just very exciting for the future as well, you know, to see what we can uh, achieve together. My first thoughts are that it looks good. I mean, at the end of the day, it needs to be quick. And that's what we're all working for. And hopefully that we can already start working on that in, in Bahrain and testing. Yeah, we are here at the at the launch of RB20. Uh, we're really happy. It's a very special day for the whole team, for the whole factory, and uh, it's it's great to see what they put together as a team. And uh, yeah, fully motivated for this season. Yeah, I I'm really hopeful. I'm really looking forward to this year. And um, yeah, just uh, want to hit track. I want to really get my best season in, in F1, so I want to improve myself in all the aspects and um, yeah, take, take another step further. It's great, you know, it's such a historic team already in F1 and uh, I'm just super happy, you know, to, to be part of this Red Bull family. I think it's um, a unique opportunity and um, yeah, really, really happy to be part of, of this great team. Yeah, it means a lot, you know, I think uh, Red Bull, it's a unique company and um, the way everyone works here, it's, it's fantastic and this is my fourth season with the team and um, it's great, I really feel at home, I really feel part of the team and um, yeah, I'm super happy, you know, really exciting and, and um, I want us to have a very good season. It's very aggressive, very aggressive concept. We, you could see a lot of changes in it and um, yeah, we will see once we hit the track. Ah, it's really cool. Uh, there's always few things changing, like uh, the jeans, like uh, um, the suits, uh, helmet. It's always, it's like a moment. You are a kid uh, when you see all this stuff new coming in and uh, it's pretty enjoyable. So we're here in Milton Keynes on the Red Bull Technology campus uh, uh, launching RB20, so uh, it's a special day today. I think 2023 was a unicorn year, but of course you're always looking to improve, we're always looking to evolve and I think the team have done an amazing job, but RB20 looks a good uh, aggressive step forward from, from RB19. It's not just a, a simple evolution, but uh, you know the stopwatch will ultimately dictate its, its outcome. Well, it's been an incredible journey. Um, obviously, being here from the beginning, you know, the early days, uh, there was a lot to do. Um, but the biggest asset of this team is the people. And uh, uh, you know, it's with great pride that everybody can look back at the achievements over the last 20 years. But of course, they're now consigned to history. It's, it's all about the next 20. Well, being part of Red Bull is, is something very special, it's unique. I mean, I think that this team, compared to any other in the pit lane, is, is just very different. Um, we have a, a very strong culture, we have a very, uh, you know, we work hard, we enjoy our racing, we play hard, and, and you know, that's, that's one of the mantras of, of Red Bull, and that's why I think we've had such tremendous loyalty from our team, from our, from our staff, from, and from our fans. 
Well, I think it's not often that we unveil the real car. So you know, what we have today is the car that will be in Bahrain next week. So uh, uh, that's, that's reasonably unique. But uh, you know, with such close proximity to that test next week, um, we felt it was the right thing to do. So we're here at the Oracle Red Bull Racing launch and uh, yeah, really excited to reveal the new car. Uh, well, I'm driving for Red Bull Racing and uh, my goals are to f for sure, you know, bring that name up and try to finish in the top three of the championship. Uh, we done really well last year uh, finishing in the top three, so I hope I could top that and uh, try to get really good results. Well, F1 Academy is, is a really good uh, championship. Well, we started last year uh, in the championship and uh, we're able to finish in the top three, which is a really strong result for me. And uh, now being part of the Red Bull family uh, this year, we hope for great results and uh, we'll try to finish and top that. Well, it's, it's an honor. It's uh, such a, an amazing team with such a great history. So to be part of it, you know, I've been watching it as a kid on TV. So it's, it's really amazing to, to finally be part of it. Yeah, I, I've grown up watching Red Bull uh, on TV, you know, F1 uh, with my father and my family. So to be finally here, it's, it's like a dream come true. It looks really cool. Uh, I was really amazed of how it looks. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to see it on track in action uh, in Jeddah. Well, I love it. I, I just got it today and uh, when I saw it, I was really excited to put it on. <laughs> it looks really cool. Uh, I love the navy blue. So yeah, to finally be in these colors, it's just uh, amazing. Yeah. It's amazing. I'm here today at Oreco Red Bull Racing. Uh, today is the launch of the F1 car and it's really nice to be part of it. Uh, I think it's really important because if the series didn't, didn't exist then I would never be part of Red Bull. So it makes a big step for me and uh, yeah, we see what the future brings to me. So. Yeah, I'm really proud of it. I used to watch it uh, when I was younger, so it was a big dream of mine. And now it's, yeah, it's a, a dream come true, so. I watched it uh, when I was younger. I watched F1 with my dad at home, so, yeah. I really love it. Uh, it's first time seeing it, and I like the blue on me, so, yeah. <laughs>